Hello again. Uh, last time we were talking to you, I was getting Bombay ready for uh, MOT test, rude worthiness test, and uh, pulling all nighter. I don't know, he's trying to get the handbrake adjusted just the way I wanted, how to make new mounts and weld, drill, and all that sort of stuff. And I was up at about quarter past eight in the morning, take me about 30 minutes getting there. And come seven o'clock, I decided right, turn the van pointer in the right direction, in the driveway, ready to go. All right, get in the van, and it would not start. Everything ready, everything ready to go, and bugger wouldn't go. Mm. A few expletive deletes were said, many were said. But turns out, uh, I thought it was a wiring problem underneath the dash, and it was the points were cropped out. So uh, put a pull out the dash, <laughs> and at the minute, just like to be in in this sort of state. You got your points in here, and that's a new set put in. And I just need to tie properly and gap right, and I'll do that later. But what I want for the minute is uh, some heavy steel piping to cut, and I need my chop saw. Or not my chop saw, my band chop saw. But I've lost the another band on it at the minute. Uh, these are a couple of old ones. This is one that snapped, and uh, I think that's a 24 tooth one. That's that's I'll try and weld that one back together. That'll be fine. Uh, this is one. Nothing wrong with the band except that I uh, tried to cut a drive shaft with it and tore every tooth off it. Give you an idea how hard the drive shafts are. So, the saw's in there, and you see the top of it. But, uh, I'm gonna definitely gonna have a good gasification uh, stove. Um, uh, for the mates down, and uh, he's willing to uh, bring a 1964 Landover to the project, and as long as we can have an engine sitting on a test bed running to prove the fact, then there's no problem with it. We'll shoot horse in, and uh, <coughs> If uh, it was going to be a sort of project where just shoehorn the biggest engine and get running into it, that would be a V6, V8 maybe, never know. But uh, that's what I've been up to, uh, being held back by this and should have been on the road. Um, should have had a ring down, should, should this, should, should that. Uh, things happen and uh, I believe things happen for a reason. Uh, this, if this had happened when we were two, three hundred miles away from home, I'd been pretty screwed. Um, so now, uh, now I'm doing points, driver cap, rotor arm, uh, plug leads, um, change the coil, uh, replace uh, a lot of the older wiring. And uh, done updating the, the whole electrical system. I was gonna change from points to uh, a wee electronic pickup, but the, decided not to. You know, I just want to keep it the way it is. But that's what's happening. That's the update. And uh, so you never you know what's gonna happen next. I don't know what's going to come next. I wanted so much, so much to do and so much to get into. One day at a time.
Peace. Have fun. Enjoy yourselves.